Hello friends, I am going to explain how to test Mivan Technologies Water Level Controller WLC110. In the WLC110 kit, you will get three number of sensor. It is a high quality carbon sensor. Uh, it is a free from oxidation, long life, long service life. It is a user manual and warranty card. Uh, so all technical details, technical data, wiring diagram, everything is included in the user manual. So there is no technical skill is required for installation of uh, this water level controller because everything is included in the user manual. Now this is the main controller unit water level controller in this package also you will get uh, one pack uh, mounting screw this is for wall mounting of this water level controller now this is the blue color high quality ABS enclosure very beautiful look water level controller it has at the terminal it has uh, one phase and neutral input and output phase neutral and the three terminal for the sensor there is a auto mode, manual mode and off. This is the three way switch. And there is a two indication for a tank. High quality ABS enclosure, uh, high quality 5.02 MKDS terminals are there. There is no compromising in the quality. Now for the, I am going to test for this test we require three number of wire one screwdriver one supply cord one bulb basically at the output terminal uh, you need to connect a motor but I am going to check so for testing purpose I am just giving the bulb and one supply cable is also one supply extension board is required now this is the supply supply cable i am just going to connect at the input terminal of water level controller this is at the input uh, you can see the phase and neutral at the phase i am giving the supply phase this is the neutral that i am going to connect at the input of the neutral this is the main supply every electronics need a supply it is a 230 volt ac you can give 220 to 280 volt it will work so i have connected phase and neutral at the input terminal This is the supply. I am going to give the supply to our controller. Uh, just connect it to the extension board and going to switching on. It is in a off mode because at the center this switch I am going to put in the manual mode. Now, because the temp is empty, so it is a no indication. Red indication are there in automate. Also, it is a red indication because the tank is empty right now when the tank is empty you will get the red indication when the tank is full you will get the yes indication now I am using a uh, bulb and uh, I am going to connect bulb at the auto output of the terminal uh, basically you need to connect the motor because for the testing purpose I am just connecting the bulb So the two wire that comes from the bulb, I am just connect a load at the output phase neutral. You can connect any two of wire at the phase and neutral now i have connected input phase neutral output phase neutral now i am going to connect a 
थ्री सेंसर टर्मिनल जी ओ एल एंड ओ एच बेसिकली यू हैव टू कनेक्ट द थ्री सेंसर एट देर बट फॉर द टेस्टिंग पर्पज आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू कनेक्ट द थ्री पीस ऑफ वायर एट जी ओ एल एंड ओ एच टर्मिनल आई हैव कनेक्टेड द जी टर्मिनल नाउ दिस इज एन ओ एल टर्मिनल This also has been connected. The last one. Basically, you can connect any sensor to any way, any three of these terminal because it is working on the based on conductivity. Uh, so I am just checking the conductivity. If this conductivity check, then the controller is working. now at the input i have connected the supply and i am just going to give the supply this is the supply at the output i have connected to the bulb and the three wire i have connected in place of sensor now the g and oil i am going to just switch on the power if the tank is empty because no sensor is connected to each other the first i have placed the unit in the auto mode and just going to switch on now the bulb is on because of the tank is empty now short g and ol g and ol sensor i have short the tank the bulb Uh, still remain on because the tank still empty now the water reach to the top sensor i have connected three of three sensor three of three wire joined together it will off because the tank is full you will get the yes indication now i have removed the oh now going to remove the ol from the g the tank start again the motor start again and tank start again to fill up now short 3 of 3 together tank full yes indication are there the motor get off